Thanks for watching. Emotions are still raw following an incident at a Rochester sandwich shop where a Muslim customer says an employee directed racial and religious slurs at her and threatened her with a knife. The employee was cited for disorderly conduct in connection to the incident, but as our Linda Haw found out, the customer says more needs to be done. She joins us live in the studio after speaking with her and the employee. Linda. Tom Vivian, good evening. She was at the subway inside of Walmart North with a friend and 11 kids when she says the employee became aggressive, making her concerned for their safety. Safiya Abdullahi has dealt with racism time and time again, each time brushing it off. But she says it crossed the line when a subway employee threatened her with a knife in front of her children. He was having a knife. He was doing to me like this. And then I was scared and I go back and I told my kids, let's go. As tensions escalated, Abdullahi claims 33-year-old Andrew Benning attempted to approach her from behind the counter, knife in hand, while yelling racial and anti-Muslim slurs. Saying like, can you go back to your country? Why are you here? I know you're Muslim. You're a stupid Muslim. Go wash your dirty hands somewhere else. She asked to speak to the manager but was unsuccessful. And then he say, my manager t do not talk to trash like you. According to a police report, three witnesses said they saw and heard Benning direct the slurs on Mrs. Abdullahi. It's very, very difficult. My kids even asking me, they're saying like, why he saying that? Because Muslim is a bad people. I say, no, Muslim is not. We are Muslim. Abdullahi is a U.S. citizen, as are her seven children, all born in the U.S. I never thought I would like go through going this through with my kids you know we come in here to be safe and to come to live a you know better life benning received a misdemeanor citation for disorderly conduct something abdullah he doesn't believe is enough today they let him go tomorrow what are he gonna do now she's demanding an apology for benning's actions people they can say you know they can make mistake and they can make right too and today, Benning still works for the subway, and when I asked him about the incident, he explained he did not intend to be racist and would not comment further. I also tried reaching out to the sandwich shop's owner and manager, but those calls have not yet been returned. The Council on American Islamic Relations is investigating the incident. Live in the studio, Linda Ha, KTTC 